So today we're gonna meet the newest member of the Cam Cannon family. His name is Slinky, and he's a little bit shy, but we're gonna see if we can pull him out here so he can make an appearance. Slinky's not shy when it comes to food. Let's see. Slinky happens to be a water monitor, an Asian water monitor. And uh, I love the monitor lizards. They're incredibly intelligent, <laughs> so smart in fact. They know when there's two people in their cage, Slinky don't like a lot of people around. So uh, I'll tell you what, let's roll the intro and afterwards there'll be a lizard over here. There are two things I've loved most in this life, bikes and reptiles. Now I crisscross the globe learning about all kinds of incredible animals. Sometimes I know what I'm doing, other times I'm in over my right, head, but one thing's for certain, We'll come away a whole lot smarter after every adventure. This is Camp Kennedy. All right, guys, so as promised, Slinky is out. Slinky really likes his hide box, but what he likes more is food, so let's try and get him interested in some of his fish. Now, it's a cool day, so he's not super hungry, but monitors are a very, very active lizard why they're called monitors. They walk around, they explore. You see that tongue flicking out, similar to a snake's tongue. It's got the Jacobson's organ on the roof of his mouth. He's able to decipher any chemical clues that are out there in the universe, or <laughs> the small part of the universe that he lives in here. These guys are from Asia, from India, all the way down through Bangladesh, into the Malay Peninsula, and into Indonesia. They have a very large range. Now, these guys will eat just about anything they can overpower or scavenge. They're true, strict carnivores. And I love this lizard, man. He's only been here three weeks, and uh, it's a really cool story. Here he goes. Oh, good boy. There you go. I hope some of you don't get upset that I'm feeding him a live fish, but usually I feed him also frozen thawed rats, chicken legs, bone, and everything. These guys have powerful digestive enzymes, and now look at this. Now he's like, well, this wasn't so bad, so maybe I'll get a little more food out of you. And you see that tongue flicking? Really smart lizard, you know? You do have to be careful. I mean, these animals do tame down, but never forget that it's a large, powerful lizard that can inflict quite a uh, pretty intense bite if it wanted to. That being said, there's a lot of reputable breeders that have been breeding these animals, and they do tame down. And if you have space, they make a fantastic animal to work with. Again, look, he wants to go back in, but you can see he's not exactly the guy that wants to be picked up, but just look at the way he moves. I mean, that is true monitor movement. That is an incredible animal, and they're related to the most famous monitor of all, the Komodo dragon. We don't have any Komodo dragons here, but Slinky is about as close as you're gonna get if you're a non-AZA accredited facility. Look at this guy. That's what I love to see. I love to see the water monitors in the water. We're actually gonna do a little bit more work to this enclosure. I want to completely redo it. I want to make a deeper water hole. I want to do a few more things. So later on in the summer, we'll do another video, a bit of a video update to show you what I have planned or the finished product. But Slinky, let's see if he'll get himself another fish. I'm just going to grab another one here. I'm a very lucky guy because I have a big pond stocked with lots of different fish. So what I'll do is I like to use tongs to feed him so he learns to associate me with a positive thing that's eating. So I like to be calm around him. Come here, Slinky. Look what I got. Look what I got. And you see how smart he is? You see that he can, he sees the movement. He knows there's something on the end of the tongs. He's very inquisitive. That tongue comes out. Come here, Slink. Or maybe not. He's making me look like I don't know what I'm talking about. Animals will do that to you. Never work with children and animals, kids. Here we go because you never know what you're going to get. Look, Slink. There we go. Yeah, that wasn't so bad, was it? So he's basically just looking around. He's upset because I shut his door. Usually he likes to come out, have a bask, have a feed, then go back in and rest. And the thing of it is, I'm closing the door because in order for him to become more and more used to me, since he's a new animal, only been here maybe three weeks, two and a half weeks, um, you want to get him used to his new routine. 
His new, uh, his old family loved him dearly. In fact, that's the reason I got the animal. Uh, they saw on Facebook that I mentioned to someone else that I was looking for a larger water monitor to work with. I had this cage, it was empty, it was ready for a nice big water monitor. And just out of sheer luck, they were looking at that thread, contacted me, we're old friends from the motocross days, and a week later, this animal was in this enclosure. So I got to help them out, they helped me out, and Slinky, well, he doesn't seem to mind the, oh, better get it, get it, and he got it. Look at that, even when it went in the water. Those are some <laughs> really sharp teeth, and trust me, you don't want to be at the business end. And the funny thing about monitor lizards is there's a lot of ends you don't want to be on, especially if this was a wild animal. Number one, that bite would hurt. He could cut me right down to the bone. Second thing, look at the claws on him. I mean, they are huge. These are some big, powerful claws. They use these to shred prey. They use them to dig while looking for prey. And then the final thing I have to tell you about is this, the tail. He might even give me a little whip. Look at this. He doesn't like it when I come from behind. And usually he'll give you a little love tap with that tail, about quarter speed. When I first got him, he and I both, watch this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna illustrate. If I stood up, look at this, see this? And I go to hit him, see? But you see, that's kind of a love tap. That's a quarter speed little tap. If he wanted to, he could leave a welt on me, trust me incredible tail so I don't want to stress him out too much because I'm actually trying to get him to really appreciate me and know that I'm the guy that's here to help him out feed him protect him and we've had some really cool bonding moments I got one more fish in here let's see if we can get it out oh there's two fish in here fantastic so what I'll do is let's see if we can get this. oh she's slinky ow slinky what the hell did I do to you buddy I didn't even move <laughs> That was a little faster than quarter speed. Come here. Let's be friends. Get that, will you? Yikes. <laughs> Slinky startled me. I love it, man. But I think I'll forgive him. What do you guys think? All right. This is it, Slink. This is the final, the final hors d'oeuvre for you. There you go, buddy. You see how he's not like really aggressively feeding? I like that. He doesn't go crazy. So that's good. So look, let's be friends. See, he just didn't like that I was making those moves or maybe I was talking too loud. Slinky's a good boy and he's done well. So the full size on this animal will be somewhere ah, close to seven, eight foot if I get really lucky. They start out small, but they grow fast. Slinky's only three and a half years old and he's already put on quite a bit of size. Well folks, I just wanted you guys to meet because you're gonna be seeing a lot more of him on my Instagram and Facebook accounts, which I can't wait for you guys to subscribe to. So if you haven't already, don't forget, hit me up on both those social media platforms to see more videos, little bonuses. And also folks, don't forget to subscribe. And Slinky is scaring the crap out of my buddy Tom, the camera guy. Go away. No, keep going Slinky. Well, well Tom, Tom, what I, happened? I'm trapped and I'm trying to shoot you. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you leave that. Anyway guys, a little bit of excitement. Tom doesn't like me, he lost his cool. Yeah. That was awesome. I love this lizard. If you have any questions, post them in the comment below. If you have a monitor lizard and you wanna share some pictures, go ahead and share them with me. I'm gonna leave you with Slinky swimming, the water monitor in the water. See you next time.